folks, here we are at our next job and it's going to be a cracker. What a view, what a day. What's going on? Oh, come on. Right, so this is the space we're working in. We've got a uh, trellis going to be here, stepping up. Got a porcelain patio, water feature in the middle there. Got these beds, loads of cladding, walls, everything. It's going to be an absolute million dollars. So this is everything's getting centered off these doors. So we've strung a line like through there, and then we've also set one parallel across the house there, so we know everything's square off that because that's the main focal point. The water feature. 
So it's going to start paving here. And then once we've got a few flags down, we'll be able to work out where everything's going off that. It's the safest way. <laughs> Yeah, it's all right, so. Cheers, Sid. That's the way they're all going, yeah? Yeah, man. Wow, they're bright, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Nice, Tom. I like them. Don't need that square, I'll get that. What? So what I've done here, obviously we've got to set the cover in and I don't do that to repave near to it. So I've just done these two flags up there on the side to get the right spacing. And then once I've put this row in here, yeah, I'll set that cover in and then pave it tomorrow.
Stealing off this pond. <laughs> <laughs> Someone give it hands. <laughs> oh, me ghoulies. We're just getting set out now for the block work, the first course of block. Everything's centered off this point. The most crucial part this, getting everything spot on. Lines everywhere. Old school with the string line. Feeling in my bones, I could feel it in my face. I can feel the winds of change You live and you learn And I hope I've seen enough To make something right Make up for what I Surprised by you Want you to make my heart feel As much as I know it should I want to get high on you Caught by surprise by you Want you to make my heart feel As much as I know it should You're not well eat It's the next best thing Stutter, Cause you love to have him all crying mm -hmm. 
call me sweet Tell me you need me But I'm from a city that's high school I give on the cinema I go uh, Cause you a bad man If she don't love money She break her feel fast I can't run When I swim down to the deep end So I just wanted to touch on what I said there about some days when you're especially when you're setting out like that, it doesn't look like you've done much that day, but I'll tell you what, there's a lot of work that's gone into it to get it to that stage. Like you just see a few blocks and the bits of wall and it looks like they've just been put in to wherever a block works out or that. But I can tell you they've been worked out to like millimeter precision because they've got to be on jobs where everything's so square and geometric you've gotta you've gotta get these lines uh to hit certain points and if they don't then it looks bad it looks awful you're talking tolerances of like millies because the joints that we lay you know you've got three mil so you've got to when you're hitting points they've got to be bang on otherwise it's gonna look bad so, yeah, it consumes you. You think, it well, personally, and I think anyone who does who's done these kind of builds, it's a uh, you you put a lot of thought into it, not just on site, but when you're at home planning your next day or the next few days, it's a uh, it consumes you a bit. Well, it should do. I think it needs to be. Otherwise, you're not gonna you're not gonna get it right. It's you've got to put the thought in. That's part of it. And then hopefully at the end it's all worth it. I'm buzzing, let's drink up your death. Look like big fun. Come on, let's get it on. Like that one fin gay song. I'm something, you love it. Come on, give me something. I know that you want it. Come on, give me something. The night is young and so Young, so are we? 
you doing, Clark? Right, how are you? I'm good, thanks, mate. Sam? What, what are you up to here, then? I'm just throwing some blocks down, that's all. What for? Yeah, just gonna put on the step up. Pardon, with some... Uh, Can't see you. Where are you? Kiwi! I'm gonna wave it to you. <laughs> yeah. So what? It's gonna form a step? Yeah. I'm and gonna what, it with flags. Nice. Gonna look sweet. So while we're on, while you're on camera, what did you have for tea last I night? I had lasagna last night, mate. Was it Home, nice? Homemade lasagna, you know what it was. With what, salad? Salad, yeah. Anything else? No, that was it, just lasagna and salad. Saved with love. No, it wasn't saved with love. <laughs> <laughs> but it was all right. Like that, that's why. That's a way of that. So we're at the end of week three now. All the main structures are in. We've got the pond 
backfill with concrete and um, we've covered that up with ply and sheets over the weekend because we're expecting rain and we need that dry for the GRP lining next week so we'll crack on again next week So what we're doing here, we're cutting into the existing tarmac, we're marking out square with what we've put in and Trey's going to cut it and I'm going to extend the paving into this area which is then going to be separated by a gate and some screening. keep it dry we've got a bench here and we've got a bench here so i'm just i've got to create a box basically to keep the soil from going in underneath the bench and give it something to sit on so what i'm going to be doing is building this out here like this I'm going to bridge it with some lintels and block up i need to take it to this height here and then i'm gonna cut into that so then the bench sails through to the edge so this is the uh, this is the design for it so i'm gonna cut out here now build that up and then the base will just sit right across that Piping. I'm going to go into this cavity at the back where the seat's going to sit. So we're using the stainless steel rectangular box section. Kiwi! <laughs> Nearly. Oh yes, like a glove. Oh, it's all right like that. Place for a spot of 
Lunch. Romantic. Lunch. I don't know about romantic. Like, <laughs> I'm not a very romantic person. Only with me. Not even with you. Oh, sorry. So, sorry, Steve. Not back. Yeah, song. one of you. Here's one we made earlier. Beautiful. Right, so it's Monday morning, we're back on the job. I don't know if it's just me, but does anyone else get like excited to go to work sometimes? Not all the time, don't get me wrong, but we're at a stage now in the job where the main structures are built, most of the paving's down, and we're onto the finishing stuff, like the cuts and the rendering and uh, the decking. So the tricky bit, as in the setting out and the planning, that's all done. So now you're just on the air, uh, the nice bits. But yeah, I do. I enjoy this part of the job. I met an old man. I said, tell me your story. He took out an old man. Wrote something for me Then he kept walking on down the road And I watched him disappear like smoke And I thought I'd just seen a ghost And I looked down at what he it said, son, when you grow up, you'll be fine I know you've got questions on your mind Life is gonna happen one way or the other way Like you know I know, stop looking for the answer And you'll find it Are you? 
doing today is taking this door off and breaking it up because it's not getting used and it'll look better with a nice clean line of the wall running through and rendering it so let's get the frame out get the door off and get it blocked up we we watch the sun go down over the same old town like so many before we look at the same old stars, battle the same old wars, like so many times before. And I know that we're not perfect, but I'm gonna miss all that we had. Yeah, I know that we're not perfect, but I need this night for the last time. Stay.
because it's only a small step up from the look, which is going to be like the lawn to this level. You're probably going to have like a step up of about 150. So instead of having like a little strip of render, you're going to be cladding the faces with the porcelain. Uh, and because the grass is running up, so it's going to be better for ma maintenance too. So we'll put all these down, all crazy cutting down. Uh, just going to get them on and then it's Friday, so we don't want to be too late. We well, probably will be. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Would you like to do it? No. I can't. I can't do it now. I don't mind you. I'm going to have to lay now. When you're no long, longer able to lay. When I'm in the box, mate. Don't say that, Dad. <laughs> I, I think that's what I'm Yeah. I think that's the thing. You need to get on the trial, lad. 
Yeah, only needs one. Yeah. We've got to put a four inch lap on the top there, yeah. So we can always lock it down. Yeah. In a minute. Yeah. Okay, so fun to go back on because it was tight against that fence. Okay, so you know, you know, before. Yeah, that's true. Do you want to put that?
just dry laying all these. Everything's been squared up from this central point here. So I'm getting them the right distance off the edge of the off the edge of the pond and getting everything square. And then I'm gonna dry, dry lay it all, cut it, and then lay them. There's no pressure here. <laughs> They're all bespoke and the eight week lead time, so yeah, no pressure at all.
creating a ramp with the soil and turf because the client wants to be able to push wheelbarrows and bins up and down here so what we're doing we're paving this side and then off this existing wall we'll be putting a flag on edge which will follow the same contour as the grass and meet this edge and um, we've stopped this wall flush with this so that's where the, the level's going to kick from this point it'll be level and then kick down to meet the flag height
level uh, it's got a slight fall towards the house but out here is a different story it's got a big fall right the way down so we've brought the gate in roughly on the height of this point which is about the average so we're going to be cutting back the tarmac here and we're going to be ramping it up to meet that height and also we're putting the flag on edge through there to hold the soil back to stop that washing through where the ground drops away on this side so obviously we're getting everything right in there but we want to make it work with the existing as well. Okay, so we're all done on the hard surface and time for a bit of greenery now. We've got this area behind us which is getting saved. 
that bit's getting seeded and then we've got the ramp in the corner which is getting turfed too it's absolutely bone dry so i'm gonna rake it out gonna damp it down firm it in rake again and get this grass down bone dry like I said so you can't compact dust so what I'm doing is just wetting this and then I'll let it soak in for a bit get on with something else and then I'll just give it a rake over again and I'll fill in.